through the contact. Incomplete. You can tell they were hoping for a flag there offensively. Several on the sideline motioning. Hey, why not a penalty? Why not a penalty? I, what did you see? Yeah, I think you've got to let them play, and the officials are instructed. If there's contact coming from both sides, no flag. Let them fight it out. And forces fourth down. Breeze to throw for it on four. And this is incomplete. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And it's... Loves it as their guys hold on the opening drive. They've got good starting field position as they come up here first and ten. Watch it now, Barney, Barney. Detroit, Detroit. From the midfield strike, they'll look to throw. He gets it left side to Johnson. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 35. 14 yards is the pickup there at a Raider first. And we see the emphasis early here. Get your star receiver involved, able to do it successfully. Not a bad start to begin with, Detroit, that's for sure. Detroit. And to me, this play says, our guy is better than your guy's because, you know, a player of his stature, Detroit, he won't just Detroit. be single covered all game long. It's going to involve multiple three, three, people. Nine. And right away, three, three, they told the other team, guess what? He's just better. All right, now, lucky 56. Lucky 56. On first and 10, Young. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And this time, not quite to the 30. It'll be down at the 31-yard line. It's a gain of six on the play, and it'll make it a second down. Young working out of the gun. Being chased out left. Five yards on the scramble, and that's enough to pick up the first. That was an excellent job of recognizing the situation. His first read wasn't there. Heck, his second read wasn't there. But he bought himself a little extra time scrambling out of the pocket, got to the sticks, and picked up the first down. Young looks to throw on first down. The left side completion to Jones. Seven yards, the pickup on the pitch and catch. An ex-teammate used to tell me all the time, I hate experienced quarterbacks because no matter what, you really can't hide what you're doing. And I think that right there, he knew right away where the blitz was coming from, where his primary guy was going to be, and he ended up going to a secondary target for a nice game. I was just going to ask you, that wasn't the primary target. And he's so good at that, isn't he? I think he knew right away that he wasn't going to get to his primary guy. I think he read that as soon as he got to the line of scrimmage, knew where the pressure was going to come from, and said, ah, I know how to beat that. And that's what he did. Give him a yard on the run there, and that's going to set up a third down and two. says the side judge incomplete fourth down after the New Orleans defense holds serve now Goskowski will come on to try a field goal this just a 35 yard attempt from the left hash and Goskowski's kick is good and the Raiders jump out to a 3-0 advantage so our initial drive of the night ends in three points. Maybe not exactly what this home crowd wanted, but they'll take the early lead. They will take it. You're exactly right. Everybody wants a touchdown. But in this case, good opening drive, put points on the board, and a lot of coaches do believe the first team to score in the game, statistically, 
often ends up the winner. Out onto the field comes New Orleans. And on that last drive, went for it on fourth, turned it over. But good job by their defense, though. They held them to three. But this offense, they've got to be a little bit better, a little bit more careful here. And sometimes when you see these calls on fourth down, when they decide to go for it, it's not necessarily the coach saying, I believe in my offense. Sometimes the coach saying, I believe in my defense. I can afford to go for it here because if we don't get it, I don't think we'll give up more than three. And that's exactly what happened there. You think there. that factored in? I do. I think that he had that in his mind going into the game, that I'm going to be aggressive on offense because I know I've got a defense that can hold up their end. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. It's Saints football to begin quarter number two. They're looking at a second and short yardage to start things out. Now before the second down play, we'll get whistles and a timeout. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. They'll operate from the 32-yard line here, second and three. On second down, here's Breeze. And he's going to drop this off to Williams, complete. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. A really nice pickup of 14 yards, and it moves the sticks. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. Eluding the pressure right. Got a man over the middle, it's Williams. And he'll be brought down at the 45-yard line. It's an eight-yard pickup, and it's a second down. He was out there waving his arms, and when you got a quarterback out of the pocket looking for any help, I guess waving the arms is helpful. It certainly is, because you got to get his attention, because now you're in scramble drill. So everyone's adjusting their routes, finding open space, and he found the right spot for the completion. At five yards on the play there as the drive will continue. I think it all came together there. In breaking route, drove it with excellent pace. Money throw right there to move the sticks. Bree's going to come up here first and ten. And he's four for four now, throwing the ball to start the drive. Now a handoff, Johnson. And this one's going to go the wrong way. Losing yardage back at the 42. That's going to go as a loss of two, and it'll be second down. If you're the coaching staff upstairs, you might want to file that play away. Do you see how fast the safety closed on that one? Coming up and run support, made a big-time tackle. Might want to try and check into a pass next time. Yeah, got him for a loss. Really, really great play defensively. Breeze to throw on second down. And he's going to drop this off to his fullback. And he'll get it inside the 40 to the 39. It'll be a three-yard gain, and it'll be third down. Okay, baby, up deep. Two minutes to play here in the first half. We're back to Atlanta right after this timeout. Now Breeze on third down. He finds Beckham complete. And he's out of bounds. Almost gets to the 10. A really good pickup of 28 yards. Cool under pressure right there, escaping the pocket and finding what I think was not his primary target. And some of these guys are just so comfortable getting outside of the, the pocket that they'll do it on purpose. Doesn't even need to be a breakdown. Just I, they move and they know it affects the defense because a lot of times you get lost in coverage in the secondary. And I think you're exactly right. Wasn't his primary target. Found a secondary guy who sprang open probably because of his movement out of the pocket. On the ground, this is Johnson. Now Whistles and the Raiders are going to signal for a timeout as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Now Breeze throwing on second down. 
That's complete right around the eight. And he'll be brought down here at the three-yard line. Now the Raiders are going to use another timeout here as he'll talk it over here before what will be an important third down. Try and run for it. Here's Johnson. No gain on the play there, and it'll bring up fourth down. And play is stopped here. Timeout. It's the defense calling the timeout here. As they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. And Bryant's kick is good. And that will tie us at 3-3. So the field goal there caps what winds up to be an 11-play drive. Well, Carter, that's a lot of offense to run there to only get three points. I just wonder, are they going to recycle those plays because they were successful in getting three? Or do you go to another section of the playbook trying to find ones that get you into the end zone and get you six? Now the Oakland offense heading back onto the field to take over. And no, last no, no, time no, no, able Patrick, to get three. It's not what they wanted. They wanted six, but they got at least something. They mustered something go out of the drive. They'll go take on. it. Just, I, I like the way you, you've Let's described go. it. Not Three, ideal, nine, but they'll take Three, it. Nine, Anything nine. to put some points on the board. But this time on offense, they don't even want to see the field goal kicker trot on the field. <laughs> they want that ball in the end zone. Yeah, they'll be going for six. Johnson with a completion over the middle. And they work this well up field across the 45. A nice gain of 21 yards. Young on first down. He'll rifle this one deep right side. So they took a shot on first down, but couldn't connect. Well, one thing that I've liked defensively is that they've shown them a lot of different looks here in the first half. They've come after them. They've sat back. I think that's what you need to do to keep an offense guessing. And they certainly have kept them on their toes. That's why they haven't had much success on the scoreboard. A second down throw for Young. Throw left side complete. It's Jones. And he'll get it out to midfield. Looks like, yeah, they'll spot it right at midfield at the 50. Yeah, the Saints signal for another timeout. As they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. They had the catch on second down, but it didn't help at all. And now they're looking at third down here. Young now from the 50. Flushed out right. And he'll just toss it away. So he throws it away, and that brings up fourth down. What's the old adage? Be quick, but don't hurry. Well, that went right out the window there. He was hurried, harassed. <laughs> that ball had to be gotten rid of. Otherwise, he was going to get sacked. And they're going to at least line up to go for it here on fourth down. Watch it now, Barney. Barney. Watch it now, Barney. Barney. Gone, gone. Gone, gone. To the air once more, Young. Oh, wide open, complete. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. Fourth down conversion plays, you usually think one, two, three yards, maybe 10. Not there. What a huge pickup as the sticks make a drastic shift forward. First down, Young. And that will be incomplete with a clock showing 18 seconds now to go. They were looking for Johnson that time, and it's second Detroit, down. Detroit. It's been my observation. There's been a nice variety of play calling defensively. You and I often talk I about an offense's ability to keep a defense off balance with what they're doing. Right, I go. think the converse has been true in this game. Yeah, I think you're right. They seem to have gone off tendency quite a bit, but only the second quarter, a lot of time to... And that is caught! Touchdown, Raiders! 
Marquise Goodwin as the first half is winding down. And the Raiders are able to cash in for six. And that touchdown gives them a touchdown lead before they attempt the extra point. What a great way to end the half. Yeah, great job to put themselves in front. And now, see on the sideline, special teams defense scrambling, saying we want to preserve this for the final moments of this second quarter. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. Back out onto the field now comes the New Orleans offense. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. And he checks this one down to Williams. And he'll be brought down right at the 30 here. Now a timeout. Seven seconds left in the first half. Ball on the 30. They'll come up with a second and five. Shotgun now for Breeze. And down he goes. Brought down a Raider sack. Time for a break. We've hit halftime. Two quarters down. Two still remain. We step aside. This is the NFL on EA Sports. And we welcome you back now. Alongside Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon, getting set for quarter number three here. The Raiders with the lead already, and they will get the football here as the second half is now underway. That'll be taken in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Out comes the Raiders' offense. They'll go on offense first to start quarter number three. They have the lead. Now they'll be looking to extend that lead. And this is where I enjoy talking about one of my favorite right, subjects, tendency breakers, or counters as I also like to call them. You've done things in a certain way in the first half, and they've had an ability to see what you've done. They're going to make their adjustments. So guess what? You adjust yourself and try and stay ahead of the pace because you are looking for some separation in this ball game. The adjustment to the adjustment. Without a doubt. <laughs> show them one thing, hit them with something else. All right, here we go. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he stopped immediately there. Officially no gain on the play, and it's second down. He has elite instincts from his linebacker spot. He's able to diagnose the run and flies in like a missile to stop that one behind the line of scrimmage. Now a second down throw for Young. He's going to fire this thing deep right side. This is caught inside the 15. And he gets this one inside the 15, just a yard or two shy of the 10. And that one results in 35 yards. So how about this for field position after the big play? Inside the 15 now as they come up on first and 10. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he is in. Touchdown.
What's up, gang? Let me go secure the game right quick. Hey, what's up, gang?